All right, hi everyone. So I thought that it would be a fantastic idea to test the pH of my milk and some yogurt that I made last night. So uh, let's see what we are working with. So with my yogurt, there is going to be a top cream layer that I'm going to take off. Oh, nice pop. Uh, and then we will test. So let's take that out so that we're only getting yogurt. All right, and the test says only half a second. So let's do the uh, milk. Oh, that cream layer on top is going to be, I got full fat milk. And yogurt. Ooh, funny. All right, let's see. All right, so I have actually stirred my milk because that cream layer is not helping. So let's try that again. And we will compare notes here. And I will show you. Super interesting. We are getting definitely a different reading between the two. The top one is, of course, yogurt. The second one is just my milk. And you can see that that first section is is pretty different and that second section we have a yellow on the top and a green on the bottom whereas these last two don't have much of a difference let's compare it with our uh indicator all right so here we go uh as you can tell the second layer definitely gets more um green than blue as you get more alkaline and mine is kind of like a mustard yellow and so as i'm looking at it it's really lining up pretty nicely with about 4.5 i would say and then here is that same 4.5 on the other side and when we go to the 5.0 th this yellow and this one right here it's looking a little bit too green so i would definitely say that i got a 4.5 ph on my yogurt so let's look at the milk one which is this one right here this one is much more green and so it looks like we're at about maybe a six maybe a 6.5 that green is really too um too dark for it to be a true neutral seven hang on let's pull out a, a fresh one that's what a fresh one looks like just in case you're wondering uh, but yeah, that doesn't look to be about a 7. It looks to be about a 6.5. <clears throat> so, very interesting. We have a 6.5 for our milk and a 4.5 for our yogurt. Absolutely a clear sign of fermentation. And once again, here are those two strips side by side. The top one is my yogurt and the bottom one is my milk. Very interesting to see, to have proof of uh, successful fermentation. Thanks for watching. Bye.